everybody sorry about my thumb it's me again I'm back um, I did a video earlier and I talked about these sheets that I did with a bunch of fabric scraps on them well I decided to take today and do some die cutting with them and this is what I got actually this one I'm sorry that one's paper uh, fabric these are all fabric um, I wanted to show you what I got. These are just so cool. I absolutely love the way that everything is different on these. I've even got the thread that ran through, you know, some of them that I glued on top of it. They're not all flat. Um, some are puffy, some are um, a little bit different. So what I was going to do is I'm going to sit here with my brads. And I'm just going to make some different little flowers out of these pieces. Hang on, let me just throw Brad on this one. Let's see. I have this cool little dish here that I purchased when I was up in New York. A friend of mine made it. She's a potter. Let me see. Uh, what color Brad should we use? I don't really have these all picked out, which is fine. So this um, one um, die that I used, it's a uh, Sizzix Tim Holtz, and this is from a long time ago. So look at that. How cool is that? Such a beautiful little flower. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to make some more of these flowers and mess around with some brads. Now this is just the one style that I did. Um, I did do a few more styles, which is this one here. I did this one here. Um, this one actually doesn't have holes in it, so I'm going to have to punch them. But yeah, I want to go ahead and make up some flowers and then I'll show you what we've got at the end. I hope you guys enjoy.
Okay, so this is what I did. I sat here and played around and made some different flowers. I'll show you the ones I've got. Um, I also had a few paper flowers sitting here on my desk, so I decided that one I gotta glue a little bit. I decided to make those up as well. These are just nothing. Um, but yeah, I wanted to show you the flowers that I made. So, you know, don't throw away those fabric scraps. If you have some fabric scraps and you don't really know what to do with them, like I said, I took them and I put them on a piece of mixed media paper. I just glued them all down and then um, just used my die cuts. Now, I did try the thinlets on these. I, honestly, I don't recommend it, but if you can get it to work, that's fabulous. I myself didn't like the way they cut, so um, again, I had to use one of the big um, brown Tim Holtz uh, die cuts. So I thought you guys might enjoy this. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching, and I would love to see if you make some fabric flowers of your own. I would love to see them. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Talk to you later. Bye.